Hello lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Gemini, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing amazing. I want to wish you guys the very best for the beginning of this month. Uh, let's get into your reading. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of September. We're starting off here with the Eight of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, Two of Pentacles, the Sun card, the Page of Wands, the Empress, and the Knight of Swords. Okay, let's see. So um, there is a bit of confusion going on at the present time, or you will be dealing with this type of energy, Gemini. Um, I see you guys walking away from a situation that has created or brought to you guys, like I said, a lot of confusion, um, not being able to see uh, clearly exactly what's going on. For some of you guys, this could be in regards to a connection. For others of you, this could be um, having to do with family, friends, relatives, um, your social circle. Now, there is a bit of restriction here in regards to the finances. I feel that for a lot of you guys, there's almost like you experience opportunities open up for you. Um, and for some reason, there's like resistance. There's some pull there that's going on where you feel like you're taking two steps forward, five steps backwards. It's almost like a constant being challenged um, to make things happen for you. So this could be indecisiveness on your part, Gemini, um, but this can also represent like obstacles that we have to overcome. Um, basically the universe challenging us, you know, wanting it is is what you're asking for gemini really really something that you want to make happen um or do you quickly lose focus or lose interest uh, so what they're telling you here is about being motivated gemini and keeping your eye on the prize like i said whether it's in regards to relationships or whether it's in regards to your finances and career um i do see possibilities here i do see uh, the opportunity to elevate, the opportunity to grow financially. For some of you guys, this is doors opening up for you in regards to going up the ladder when we're talking about career, um, taking methodical moves or changes that are going to be for the betterment of your growth. Um, but you got to let go of the fears. You got to let go of doubting yourself or feeling uh, like you're not really capable of doing whatever it is that you're setting out for um so it's almost this energy of wanting to manifest a certain uh, you know a certain outcome uh when we're talking about career when we're talking about finances but on a subconscious level there is fear that you know you may not attain that or that it may not happen for you and what spirit is telling you is you have all the potential gemini um, not only to make those moves to really be able to see the fruits of your labor, but it also speaks directly about your self-belief. So I feel that for the month of September, it's going to be very important and crucial to really analyze, really internalize um, what are some of the dogmas, what are some of the things that were taught to you in early childhood, whether it was taught to you or whether you learned it um, from others and, and seeing others' experiences, what is it that you allow to hold yourself back? Is it self-belief um, or self-doubt? Is it, um, like I said, what you've been taught or what you've seen um, as an outcome for other people? Uh, whatever the situation is, it's almost like it's a, lim a limiting belief. Um, so I would really encourage you guys to internalize, um, to really dig deep when we're talking about sorry guys, um, when we're talking about 
you know, dreams and aspirations. Um, it's okay. Obviously, it's very crucial and important to have goals and aspirations. But um, as well as when it comes to that, it's very important and crucial to really um, think about, you know, is it something that you really feel deep down is that you're worthy of it? Because if you go believing certain things and wanting to make certain things happen, but deep down inside you there is doubt or there is a feeling of unworthiness or there is a feeling of not being able to achieve that because my parents didn't, because my cousins didn't, because whatever the situation is, you're the one that has already accepted that outcome or has already accepted that life or that destiny. Do you see what I'm saying? So what they're telling you here is you have all the potential, but you need to learn to focus and to really believe in yourself, Gemini. Let doubts, whatever fears are holding you back, let it out the door and watch how quickly you start to flourish. Watch how quickly you start to be in your own truth and advance in life, in any aspect of your life, because you are worthy. I hope that makes sense. I wish you guys the very best and we'll see each other soon. Bye.